You know the persona, if not the man, self-styled heir to boxing's throne. If Mayweather was money, AB would tally billions. But now Floyd's left the stage, and you're left to wonder, was Broner merely playing a role, or did the role play him? You've taken a couple losses last two years, haven't knocked anyone out. Convince me that we're about to start the Adrian Broner era. The only way you can be convinced if you if you watch. And that's one reason I didn't do any interviews. You know, because you know, uh, I had nothing to say. All I gotta do is prove what I do inside that ring. You said earlier you have something to prove to yourself. What is that? That I can be the four time world champion of four different weight classes. That I am gonna be the four time world champion of four different weight classes Saturday night. Four times is nothing. It's really about succeeding Floyd as the number one attraction in the sport, is it not? I don't know how you feel, but have you ever won one? Mm -hmm. Okay, so you can't say four times is nothing. See, you got guys like you, and you got guys like people out there that are computer gangsters, that are, um, you know, you, you beat up boxers with your mouth because you know how to talk, but at the end of the day, until you really get inside that ring, you can't say four times nothing. So to me, four times is everything. Cause you, cause tomorrow is never promised. So don't ever, don't ever tell me, and I hope you don't ever tell another boxer that one of their accomplishments is nothing. Let me go back to the Porter fight for a second. You, you said Sean Porter didn't beat you, you, you beat yourself. How so? Anybody can watch that fight and, and just look like, you know, that wasn't the full Adrian Brown. And me personally, I know that. And um, I really don't want to get into what I, what I really feel because I, only I know that I beat myself that night. And I can, I can assure you it won't happen again. But it's important for the people to know. It, re no, it really is. I see a guy mm -hmm. with a big chin I see a guy with enormous talent, but I also saw a guy who wasn't what he should have been that night. Tell me why you weren't, man. It ain't for me to explain, you know. Do you feel like you let anyone else down? Your kids, family? When it comes to boxing, man, I don't, I don't look at boxing like that. You know, you got people who, who get in the ring and they fighting like, oh, I let this person down, I let this person down. The, the, the biggest thing for me is leaving the ring knowing you could have did more. You know, that's, that's, that's what, that's what brings tears to my eyes, man. When, when I leave the ring and I know I could have did more, you know, that's what hurt me, so, you know. Adrian, what should you be? I should be the next one to take over this boxing game, point blank period. The guy who lost to Porter, we're never gonna see him again, huh? Don't get me wrong, I'm still A.B., always balling. But this Adrian Bronner, this second half of my career, I'm going to be about business and I'm going to be about boxing.